first I'd like to say a massive thank you to anyone who subscribed to my channel or liked or commented on my last video because like, the support after a first video is just, it means the actual, absolute world to me and uh, I can't say thank you enough. But first uh, I'm going to be applying the Barry M Glamour's Primer. I'll level my fist. I thought this had been discontinued but I found it in Boots today so it's all good. And I'm applying the Gosh Foundation Drops all over my face, just dotting it around and you know you're done when you look a bit metal. Watch that bit that I put underneath my, on my neck as well because I forgot about that, I forgot to blend it and I found it a little bit later in the video. <laughs> I'm just blending this in with a damp Real Techniques complexion sponge. <laughs> Balm because Perry Edwards she has a fit footballer boyfriend who so she needs some moisturized lips for smooching and I was listening to power all the way through filming this video because it's just an absolute banger so if you can see me singing a dancer then that's why and I'm combing through my brows with a spoolie and filling them in with the Soap and Glory Brow Archery Pencil. Now in this video Perry is going for a, a hippie chic look which is very hair and her brows are really thick and bushy and lovely. And I'm just combing them through with the Essence uh, Clear Brow Mascara. And having a bit of a dance. Now I'm using the Too Faced Chocolate Bar Palette. At first I'm going to prime my eyeballs. Starting with milk chocolate, popping that through the crease with a big fluffy brush, just smooshing it in there. Do a bit more dancing. Um, and now I'm adding semi-sweet into the outer corners and the crease and just underneath the eye bit as well. Just add a bit more definition. Now while you're just watching me blend I thought I'd talk a bit more about why I enjoy Little Mix, make little mix Makeup so much. Um, it's always very original, uh, they're makeup artists. Uh, Adam Burrell and Heidi, Heidi North are just so talented and and Adam I know Adam Burrell does a lot of uh, stuff with Barry M which is one of my favourite favourite makeup companies so I just I have a soft spot and plus like a little mix of flawless and just now I'm putting a little bit more of the milk chocolate colour just on the inside of my inside colour of my eye where it meets my nose and then I'm going in with a little bit of the Essence Super Thin Liner, just on the upper lashes. And Perry Edwards, I think Perry Edwards quite likes this inner corner wing. Just a little bit of an extension in the inner corner, which is quite difficult to do. So yeah, just take your time with this. And if you mess up, you can just use a cotton bud. Now I'm putting some of the Barry M Brown Coal Liner in my little waterline, just to tie it all together. Using 
Chocolate Fudge from the Chocolate Bar palette. Just on the very outer corner and along the lashes. Just because it looks very smoked out here. And I know this is only my second video, but I'm going to say it anyway, the classic YouTuber phrase. When you're blending eyeshadow, the best thing to do is start with a little, blend it all out, add a little bit more, carry on blending, and just keep adding, blending, adding, blending, because it's the best way to gain the most intensity in the neatest possible way. And I, I, I know this is my first video, but I cropped out literally about five, five minutes of footage of me just adding, blending, adding, blending. And now I'm adding some gemstones that I got from Primark and Claire's. Very inexpensive. They're sticky on the back, you just have to whap them on your face. And I'm adding the Collection Glam Crystal Liners. I think these are the silver and gold ones. And I'm taking the silver just in that space, the inner corner, just in the middle of that inner wing. And I'm gonna start applying rhinestones. Now I didn't include most of the footage of this because if I did it would be a very long video of you just watching me pick rhinestones off the floor because there I just did it I keep drop I kept dropping rhinestones so we'll fast, for fast forward to where I've got most of them on my face I'm just applying those with tweezers and pressing them down with the, the blunt edge of the tweezers and it takes some time but as you can see it looks really cool and I'm not even joking I found these rhinestones everywhere in my room. I found them in my shoes, I found them in my bed. They just got everywhere. Yes, I love the place. That looks super cool. Now for some bronzer, Soap and Glory Solar Powder. Uh, and there, I found the bit that I forgot to blend in my foundation on my neck. Brilliant. Great one. And now I'm adding the Essence Slash Princess Mascara to my upper lashes. Barium feature length mascara to my lower lashes. I like this one for my lower lashes just because it's nice and thin, doesn't smudge everywhere. You know the drill. Now I'm just adding a bit of the NYX blush and taupe just to the just underneath my cheekbones, just to make my face look a bit more defined, my cheekbones look a bit more chiseled. Just doing that with my blending brush so it's nice and subtle and adding the highlight end of the NYX Wonder Pencil, Wonder 6 sorry. The girls in the, bar in the Little Mix music video clearly didn't have very much glittery highlight on, they just had a lot of matte highlight. And then I'm adding the Essence Lip Liner in Soft Berry to my lips. it off with just a plain brown gloss that I've got and passing that in with my finger and then off camera I applied the Isla Kimberly texture lashes I think they're called number one five threes I think but then I'm, I think that's a look done take my hair down thank you so much for watching guys I hope you love little mix just as much as I do and I'll see you in my next video love you bye